Let's see this thing, man. Oh my god! What's going on guys? This is Ryan with Two Guys Gaming and today I'm going to play a game that probably a lot of you guys haven't heard of before. That game is called LSD Dream Emulator. This game has uh, a pretty small cult following to it and I decided to go ahead and give it a try. Uh, this game is completely random, has no specific goals, levels, enemies, anything like that. The game can make you think, it can scare you, and it can make you laugh. Now there are a lot of people who have done videos on this game already, people like Agent Bakery and Azerite Reaction, but I wanted to do mine a little bit different. Ah, there we are. How are you doing? I'm Ryan, and uh, I'm in a dark room about to play a game. Now why did I put myself in a dark room? Well, that's because, from what I've heard, this game can be pretty scary if you're playing it in the dark. Um, I've watched a lot of videos and I uh, heard a lot of reaction, uh, Azerite reaction and Agent Bakery, uh, they're always screaming <laughs> when they see something random and I kinda wanted to see if uh, those emotions were maybe exaggerated or something so I'm gonna go ahead and give this game a try and uh, and see what I think so wish me luck as you can see I'm on day 13 I've only played this game you know, 11 or 12 times. Just kind of familiarize myself with the controls. Haven't really uh, seen much. And I'm going to try to explain this game as best as I can if you guys haven't seen it before. This game is based on uh, the designer's dreams. He kept a dream journal. And this game is completely random at best. You will see different landscapes or, or levels or dreams. I'm not sure exactly what you call them. And there are no goals in this game. You run around and basically discover stuff. And like this. What is that? I have no idea what that is even. Looks like chairs stacked on top of each other with that origami person on top or something. Well, I'm going to show you something. If you touch an object. What happens is the screen goes white just like you're seeing now and you go to a different whoa a different place. What the heck is going on? What is that? So it looks like some ninja kicking a ball back to himself. Like I said, there's no goal, so you just run around and you look at things and I guess I guess your goal would be to try to get the best dream possible. And uh, from what I hear if you run into objects or people or animals, then uh, your dreams get more weird and weird as you go. Whoa. Uh, it's a good time to tell you that textures change. I've actually been to this uh, to this dream, and the textures didn't look anything like this. But uh, kind of nerve wracking. Whoa. Some kid pushing a hula hoop with a stick. This dream.
Well, nothing better. Shit. See where she takes me. Oh, this ain't bad. call them. Um, I think if he gets close to you, like your screen flashes and you you lose the ability to replay your dreams, I think is the way it is. I think um, as you play this game and you get so many days into it, you can actually replay some of your dreams. And if you run into that guy, he takes away your ability to do that. Uh, see, this ain't bad. Oh my god! Oh my god, guys. I'm not even kidding. That scared the living crap out of me. What is that? Oh my god. That literally scared the crap out of me. Every time I go there, inside that room, there's nothing there. Oh, Jesus! One... Holy crap. Oh, well. That literally scared the crap out of me. Wow. <laughs> what a way to start off a dream. Okay, so... Thank you. 
Yeah, the faces. I've never seen that before. You know, I'm gonna hit the side rail rather than go through the mouth. I'm gonna see what this does. Ah, textures have changed. Now, this is the room that I started off with. In fact, I think just right around the corner here to the right is where that face was. So, I'll put money on it. There's nothing there this time. See? That's normally how it is. It's normally completely blank. So when I looked there last time and I saw that, it scared the crap out of me. kidding me? That was like a nightmare. That's like right in the middle. Wow. Well, that's, uh, that was fun.